everybody. My name is Shiga Mudinana. We are here at our first Patreon call with Koyu Dai. Say hello, Koyu. Hi. Hello. Oh. Hi. Wow. I'm here with a couple of the voice actors who are going to introduce themselves right now so you know who's talking. So, let's see. I'm going to let you guys decide who goes first. Introductions. Let's see how this works out. Uh oh. Oh, oh God. God. Like Hunger Games. <laughs> Um, I'm going first. Hi, I'm. You just cut out. Hi, <laughs> 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 C. Hello, C. Hello, C. <laughs> Wait. I see you like a drink. <laughs> if only we knew what C did for Shion. This isn't working. Wait, what are you talking about? It got cut off, and all we heard was C. Okay. Hi, I'm C. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm C. Hi! Shut up, I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm JC, and I voice act Len Kagamine. That's my microwave. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a microwave or a bomb? <laughs> What's the difference? <laughs> His name is Randall. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next. Hi, I'm Tundra, and I like ice cream. <laughs> You, you. It's all right. <laughs> it's just all right. Heartbroken. It's just all right. <laughs> Should be amazing. Seven out of ten. With I ice am... again. With ice. I... <laughs> Heartbroken. You're gonna break so many fangirls' little hearts, Sandra. It's just okay with you, isn't it? All right. Next, Mary, go. Hi. I'm MC Ballad, and I do <laughs> sexy things with music. That's all you do? <laughs> <laughs> yes. MC Ballad just does things with music only. MC Ballad has no other role in Cheon. <coughs> literally, I just, um, literally, I just make music, I do music, I sing music, I screw music, I, I do wait, pretty much everything. Wait. <laughs> wait. <laughs> <laughs> Calm down. Okay, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was your dad. Fine, 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 fine. I um, have many dads. <laughs> I think Max, you can have is two, but okay. I'm MC. I'm MC Ballad. Have... These people call me Maru, except for the director who calls me Mary every chance she gets, and I, got... I play. Hang on. Hang on, hang on. Let's get something straight. I was the first one to call you Mary. <laughs> really? Yes. Shocker. Yeah. It's in Harry's fucking Superman. <laughs> Flood Dickens. Oh, cause why is next to you? Okay. Oh, I see. I see how. I see how that goes. Dude, you coined yeah. that? Yeah, I'm the first person that ever called you Mary. Stop being so damn precocious. Precocious. You. <laughs> this up worth me. Mary, would you like to say the other thing that you do for Shion? It's kind of a minute detail, but, you know, I think we should mention it. Maybe once. Yeah, yeah, sure. I mean, it's it's really not that big of a deal, but I voice act the main character, Kiyotaro Hiyama. It's, it's, it's nothing. It's NBD. <laughs> Meh. 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 Next, who's going now? I volunteer on cool. Uncool is. <laughs> oh, she dropped. Dang it! Okay. <laughs> I volunteer Aries tribute. Uh, okay, I'm Aries. I'm white. I voice act. God, words. <laughs> you voice act. He's our cleaning lady. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I look up the words whenever people use words I don't understand. Yeah. He's our cleaning lady. Apparently, precocious <laughs> means having developed certain abilities younger than usual. That's what it means. I thought it just—I thought it was just another word for like weirdly cute. No. No. Was that what you were going for? Because yes, you had yes, a lot was. of other words. <laughs> Stop being weirdly cute. Okay. That's okay. I guess. Whatever. Whatever. Well, float your boat, Mary. I volunteer. <laughs> Harry plays a secret character that you really should already know because you know, kind of bad. Because eggplant. Eggplant. <laughs> All right, next, Devin. I volunteered Devin as tribute. I volunteered Devin. Ain't I the last one though? 
slow. Okay, uncool. fine, then we can be loud. If Uncool comes back, she can introduce herself. Did Uncool come back yet? No. Uh, uncool was here. Alright, so yeah, Uncool isn't here right now, so she can introduce herself, but Uncool may pop back in later. She plays Mako. Whatever she returns. And then last but not least, my left arm. <laughs> Your left palm. My left palm! <laughs> I'm Devin, and I voice the Mika Mika Me, and I do the video editing things. I voice the Mika Mika Me. I voice the Mika Mika Me. <laughs> Because it's just a great phrase. Alright, so <laughs> today we're going to have a conversation with our buddy Koyu, who was yep. gracious enough to donate on our Patreon. Uncool, hi! And hi. we're back. Uncool! Uncool is returned. Uncool, introduce yourself. Oh. Save us from the awkward. Oh. Hi, I'm Uncool. And? I'm Uncool. And I, I play Mako and Nanami. And yeah. And yeah, yeah is my favorite character. Yeah. <laughs> yeah is best girl. Yeah, is I'm best not. Game. Yeah, I'm best girl. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! Yes, best girl. Did you just insult the Miku? <laughs> you insulted the Miku. <laughs> you insulted Ooh. the Miku. You. Well, you know what, Miku? I'm an upgrade of your flawed design. <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you remember that video we made? We put it yes, on my phone. I don't remember. Fuck you, say you. Yeah, but yeah, it's best human. I'm gonna <laughs> link back to it. Previously on Devin's channel. I am an upgrade. I have the same basic structure as Mako, but my components are far more advanced. Fuck you, say you little bitch. Alright, so Koyu, do you have any questions for us? Uh, let's see. I would just like to ask how the recording process works. How does it... How does Okay, um, she... Places. Mara, do you like to explain? Um, voice I think he process. said something about, um, uh, recording and, uh, voice acting and stuff. Basically, uh, what we do is that we all get the script and we all do the lines. And, uh, after we all do the lines, um, a mix process... They also have to meet with me. What? Alright, I'll explain the process. So first they write the script, and then everybody has to meet with me just to make sure that I know exactly the tonation that they're using for the lines. And then once they've met with me, they have my okay to record their lines, and then they record their lines, and then they send it to our audio mixers, who start working on that part. Yeah, and uh, <clears throat> that happens, yes. Mara's good at explaining things. I'm so good. Is it rambling? You're also good at walking up to strangers and just talking to them like they're doing forever. <laughs> so back at Animazement, basically, we would just give Maru a business card and say, Go! Go make friends! <laughs> Get that Tell people to come to our panel. And you know what I would do? I would say, Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Do you have a moment for our Lord and Savior, Hatsune Miku? <laughs> oh my freak god. <laughs> well, I mean, what How many times did work? work? It worked and because we so had like damn 50 smooth with it too. We had like fifty people show up to the panel, so he had to have done something right. Unless we're really that popular. <laughs> I was no at an amazement right when the con uh right when the panel's starting, I, I literally just had a piece of paper that said uh Shion panel or whatever and I just ran all around doing Yeah, you did doing weird shit. And then and Devin had then, to go find you. Wait, yeah, didn't she I run did. in like halfway through? What? I went. No, he didn't. Okay, this sorry. I thought you remembered that. But, but like, I went out to go get him, and then someone's like, "Can I have your picture?" And I'm like, "Okay." I stopped like three seconds to let them take a picture, and, and then, then I was I, gone. And then you were all the way on the other side of the thing. How did you get that quick? <laughs> Maru is is very hard to control. Yes, I am. You cannot hold me. I will swoosh right in. You will swoosh away into the night. The well, mic. Y'all can swoosh with me. Nobody can swoosh with well, me. Well, you could just calm the, the fuck down for two seconds. Yeah, you can do that. I can, if it's impossible. What? I don't know. What? There's a lot. You get right into the. Oh, it's just at the beginning. Yeah. 
I made but, hope. I made hope jokes to a Kamaya to, to get her to get in the panel. Mm. <laughs> Plus, the whole time we were at anime summit, Marie would just whisper in my ear, "Go me, me, me," and then I'd yell it out. I was like a like a telephone. What's those things you talk into? It Mega makes you louder. Megaphone. Yeah. Oh, Megaphone. you remember that thing that we were doing? That'll be cool. Which one? Remember the, uh, the synchronized <laughs> singing thing? And then Devin would jump in. I would sing World is Mine, and then Maru would do harmonies, and Devin would go, You know? At the end, it was the cutest thing in the entire world. Oh, yeah, like, that was, that was cool. We can't do that here because it's a damn Skype call and Skype lag. Yeah. So, yep. Patreon things? Patreon <laughs> things. Excuse me. Okay. Uh, anything else you want to know, Kelly? Well, I was about to ask, like, how you guys met. How we met. <laughs> yeah, I'm all over the. You got mumbly again. You got mumbly again. I couldn't hear half of that. Okay, so. Would you also be able to write down what, you, what you're what you saying as well? Because a lot of it gets cut off in the mumble. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, put it in the chat or something. Not a problem. But, uh, yeah, I think he uh, said something about, like, how we first met and stuff like that. Then, so, then um, right now, wait, first, first let him ask the question. Maru's <laughs> Mar's like, okay, this is what I think happened, so we're just gonna go with that. Uh, no? <laughs> That's how dog and Ropa works! <laughs> it's not a Maru? No, it all key, yeah. <laughs> Hashtag no, it all key, yeah. Remember, you only did it if you get caught. <laughs> Hashtag, this is why you got fired. <laughs> <laughs> Your kid doesn't love you. <laughs> oh, wow! <laughs> wow, Nana! All right, so why your life is, your wife how did this you. come to be and how did you guys get to know each other? Okay, so, I started watching this show, which a lot, I'm sure a lot of people have heard of. It's called Welcome to Vocaloid. And there's a fly in my face. So I started watching Welcome to Vocaloid, and basically something that bothered me about welcome to vocaloid was the fact that like literally every single well, like it was kind of generic in the sense where miku was the main character and everybody was in high school and it was like all that kind of stuff so i'm just kind of like oh, we need another story so at the time i was really into kaito so i'm like kaito needs a time some time to shine so it kind of evolved around kaito and then Kyo just sort of became the main character because he looked like the master character I had in mind anyway. And I'm like, what's a vocal way that looks like? I'm okay. And that, that's basically the evolution of Shion. In terms of how we met, I I actually just Google searched Kyo Tenu audition and Maru's is the first one that popped up. And I'm like, hey, his voice works. Hey, you want to do a thing? And he's like, mm, okay. I didn't... It and was then... a literal just leap of faith. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Aren't you glad? Oh my God. Aren't you it glad you said yes, a... Mary? <sighs> no joke. Uh, all joking aside, yes, I, I'm so glad to have met so many awesome people doing the thing. Aw, Being Mary. stuff. Oh my, oh my god. You guys are awesome! Aw, we love you, Mary. Aww. You're awesome! <laughs> so I think the next person that, that I actually met was Devin, and Devin contacted me and said, hey, if you need a Miku voice. And I'm like, okay. We could do the Miku thing. So Devin became Miku. And then I think... I thought it was cool. It was before me. No. We had another Miku at the time, but... That yeah, there was another Mako, and then... Yeah, cool's that the Mako left. Cool's I remember because... Um, I remember because... Me and... Before Skype... Before I had a Skype, Nana and I were talking through email. Because I sent in... A, I actually sent in an audition for Xion. So... I, I Jason was one of the only ones. ones. I was gonna get to Jason yes, next, I'm actually. So bitter, so freaking bitter. JC was the next one <laughs> I met, and she actually auditioned for Shion. She auditioned for Len, and she got the role because her Len is, you know, you all know how bay her Len is. So she yeah, got the role uh, for Len. And <laughs> she's bitter that she was the only person that auditioned. Actually, yeah, like you literally. Devin and Cool also had to audition. You were the only one to send in an audition to that video, but Devin and Cool. I was the only unknown. One. One. But, um, so basically after that, Nana and I, like, talked through email before, like, I, I knew Skype really existed. So we have, I have, a, I still have the emails, our first emails of, like, what we were messaging to each other. 
And you you actually sent me on audition for me. So that's how hey, I know. Because Na Nana auditioned for Rin on her own channel, didn't she? Yeah, I auditioned for Rin on my channel, and then I was gonna do Rin and Len, and then I found JC, and I'm like, JC is a pretty badass Len. So I I was like, okay, JC's Len, and then I found Desi originally. And then I'm like, oh, I like her in. And she said yes. So I'm like, okay, Desi will be in. And then, uh, what's it called? So I, I kind of just like took the back seat. And I'm like, okay, I don't have to be a voice actor for a while. And um, no, actually, Tundra auditioned too, Jess. He sent me his audition as well. I did. Yeah, he actually auditioned with my friend because my my old one of my old best friends was helping me with it as well at the time. So he sent his audition to I her. I remember because she sent it to me. Yeah. She was the first one to comment on my audition, too. Because mm -hmm. she was helping me cast at the time. She was actually supposed to be Haku, but things happen. <laughs> because I luckily go or YouTubed voice actors needed. And then there was some really sketch-looking video about Kaito. And I'm like, sure, this seems like a good idea. <laughs> was it a good idea? Really sketch. It was a sketch video. I'm sure it. I... I put a gun clocker in my mouth, that's a good idea. Oh, yes. <laughs> but. Best video. It reminded me of, like, I've YouTubed voice actors needed quite a lot. And it reminded me of, like, these videos that you see, like, I don't know, probably 10 year old girls holding their My Little Ponies in front of the camera, and you can see their arms. Well, like, make sure to subscribe and to my very channel. Like, say, Hi, I'm April Dash, and I need voice actors. <laughs> it kind of reminded me of that. Oh, God. <laughs> Is that how the cluster was made? What? <laughs> Wait. What are you guys even talking about anymore, man? <laughs> I don't know what this is. I need to know. <laughs> Talk about things. <laughs> I'm so confused right now. I know, right? <laughs> I thought it was going to go poorly and it went well. <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of words. I zoned out for a minute and then I come back to Rainbow Dash. Wait, <laughs> what? Message received. But yeah, I our audition. That. I had to say, like, penises and I had to oh sing Rolling Girl. I had to say the Wait. devil's ass crack. My audition lines were very, very interesting. They were, no, I, they were. I think quite yeah, a... I don't remember the Rin ones. Yeah, but it was, it... I do too. Actually, we can read them if you guys want. Okay. Hey, not. hey I, I don't want to read Let's them. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. I remember. I remember mine. Wait, 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 Ari, you're not getting out of this. You, you share your story of how you met with the Kaminari Enter Enterprise crew. Actually, okay. I'm gonna. Do you mind if I tell the story? Fine. Okay. I mean, if you want to. I, I was going to tell how I met Uncool first. Okay, you can go to that. Okay. So, yeah, like, I was a weeb way back when. And I was like, dude, I want to join a course. So I joined a course. And there's like, yo, Uncool's in the course. And I was like, cool. And there's like, Uncool, <laughs> but cool. And then, uh, yeah, so we're in a course together. And. Nothing really came out of that course, I think. Like, maybe one cover. I don't remember. Nope, nothing. Like, nothing. Yeah, I, I, I knew I knew it was either, like, it was very nothing. little to none. But we met each other, and it was like, okay, we're going to be the next Hanatan and Pokita. And it was like, yeah. wait, but we're not. <laughs> because we're, not. we're too lazy to cover songs. <laughs> too lazy? <laughs> oh, okay. that's, that's how we met. So. Mm -hmm. Alright, so, yeah. essentially, we used to have another Gakpo in the beginning. And that Gakpo didn't turn out so well, so Uncool was like, I know this guy, he'd make a good Gakupo. So she brought him in, we gave him a shot, and he's he's pretty awesome Gakupo. I almost didn't... He didn't tell him my story. <laughs> Which... Wait, what? The story of I got to she on. Uncool's story was pretty cool, too. Uncool's story was... So we originally had another Mako as well, but, oh. you know, she... She was very inactive, and she didn't really seem like she was into it too much. Lots of things usually. So I Google. I you know my foolproof method of uh, Google searching voice actors. I Google search <laughs> Mako 
I was in Mako, uh, what did I say? I think, uh, Mako audition. And I find I it bet, I bet cool. Mokopan audition was the thing that popped up for Uncool, right? I think so, yeah. So yep. I got a Mako audition. And I'm like, okay, Mako, hello. So I'm, uh, I'm listening to her voice. And I'm like, okay, I'll send her a message. And at this point, you know, most of the voice actors were filled except Mako. And obviously Mako's the main role. We needed Mako quickly. Because, you know, our old Mako had just recently left. So Uncool gets back to me. And she's like... You know, she's like, oh, yes, I would love to be in a thing. This sounds so much fun. And so I had her audition as well. So it wasn't just you, JC. Everybody had to audition. And like You sent me her audition. Yes. But it wasn't the lines that you wrote down. <laughs> it wasn't? No. They were different. She well, had a one of them was sample, like a voice sample. I guess I guess we were probably under what's it called a time limit or something. Also, fun fact: Nana asked me to play Uncool after um, the other Uncool, Uncool left. So if I said, I mean, no, please <laughs> make Oh man, that's <laughs> not Uncool. Uncool is Mako. Uncool is Mako. I am my role. I am Mako. <laughs> if I had said yes, then we wouldn't have had Uncool because then I would have been Mako. Thou art Mako. And we wouldn't have a Len. Mako art Thou. I think we would have had a Len, we just might have been something. Yeah, I probably would have been Len, and that wouldn't have been very good. It would be so oh, weird yes. imagining other people as different. It would, yeah. Oh, yeah. We moved to Skype, and then now we're friends. Yes, and, uh, oh, and Cool is the, basically the reason why we have, you know, a Skype group. Because originally I was just going to be like, okay, everybody's going to correspond through email, and that's how we'll get this done. And Uncool's like, why don't we take a Skype group? And I'm like, that sounds like a horrible idea. And then we made it, and then we became best friends. <laughs> this was I like on. had a, I had a mini panic attack when it's just like, we're gonna have a group Skype thing. And I was like, what? I have to talk to a lot of people at one time? <laughs> what is this? Because I was just used to messaging Nana. Like, me and Nana emailed, like, all the time. <laughs> you mean Still. to tell me that we have to interact with each other to be a crew? Oh my goodness, I have to be a friend? And since Pi was technically supposed to be in this call, I guess I'll tell the story of how I met him, too. So... Ah, uh, yes, the other character. He's so cute. <laughs> other character? Other character. So met that I met favorite character. <laughs> so, those of you that don't know, Pi is, is Mr. Yamada. So, Pi obviously wasn't supposed to be Mr. Yamada. So that old Gakko that I mentioned, he was helping me write the script for a little while. And Mr. Yamada was kind of just supposed to be like a side character that appeared once. But for some reason, you know, he made him appear a couple times, and I'm like, oh, okay. So we had him a, a few times appear, and people started, you know, when we do read-throughs of the script, they liked him. And originally, that old Gakpo was also supposed to play Yamada, because as I said, he was only supposed to appear, like, once or twice, and, like, never again. So I'm like, okay, and then Gakpo's not supposed to show up for a while. So well, after a while, this character started getting a lot bigger, and I'm like, okay, I don't, you know, we don't, we can't really have... Gakpo playing two major characters, so I had Gakpo, I mean, I had uh, this, you know, Pi joins the group for the sake of animation. He's like, hey, I know how to use MMD. Actually, he he messaged me because he wanted to play Kaito. I'm like, oh, we already have a Kaito, actually, but I can, but we're just really looking for animators. He's like, oh, okay, I know how to use MMD. So I got Pi in for animation, which, you know, he was an animator before anything. And the first time I heard him in a Skype group, you know, he was like 14 years old, so his voice was like high pitched and like prepubescent and adorable. So <laughs> he was so little. So I'm like, okay, he was super cute. Yes, he, he, so originally he was casted to play a character who is a spoiler, and I can't mention his name, but he was a much, you know, younger character. So you know, I was like super duper excited because he was adorable. And then after a while, you know, I started thinking about, like, we can't really have, you know, the old Gakpo playing both Yamada and Gakpo. That's just going to be way too much, especially if, if Yamada becomes such a big character and such a, you know, big part of the series. So I asked Pai to do a couple lines for him. I'm like, he's probably not going to appear again. Just do your best. And, you know, Pai had to strain his voice because he was so little at the time. Mm -hmm. So, you know, Yamada's 30 years old and Pai was 14. So, Hi. and eventually Yamada just accidentally became the main character. 
which is one of my favorite things because he wasn't supposed to be at all. But it's probably one of like the best things ever for the show for Yamada to be such an important character because he's like awesome. It's well, that was interesting to know. Yeah, he's yeah. a fan favorite. Fan favorite. Yamada almost wasn't important. <laughs> Who's Yamato? I'm gonna oh punch gosh. you. Just kidding! Go we. <laughs> punch you in the face. I didn't know you were was saying that, and I was like, who said that? <laughs> you you that. Hey, so <clears throat> that was a very long, long explanation. Any other questions? Do you have another question? Mm, I guess like. House production of uh, episode 18 here. You're monthly again. We have half an hour left. I need to get a new mic. Um, he asked something about episode 8. Uh, like, uh, uh, how's the production? Say, so you asked I about episode 8. I think fluent in mumbling. Yeah, because I do it all the time. <laughs> yeah, that's very true. So, you asked about episode 8, you said? How is the production of 8, of eight going? Um, well, we're in the final stages of editing. I can't give you an exact date for release, but I think we're doing pretty well so far, so. Cool, good to know. Uh, hmm, let's see. Think about all the burning questions all your fellow fans might be asking. Fans that may want, hmm. Let's see, um, well it's not a question, but I would say I like that Halloween special you guys do. Oh, you did? Well, thank you. <laughs> Hopefully we're planning to make a couple of more things in that style. Mo mainly, like, Halloween. I mean, not, not Halloween, like, holidays. Oh, it's a lot of fun to Basically, make. Basically, short really episodes. I enjoy out. that. Short episodes. That mm -hmm. See, that yeah. one, actually, 90% of the reason that went through was Devin, actually. Um, I was... I, I started it, and it didn't seem like it was flying with a lot of people, so I was kind of like, okay, whatever, it's not that great a thing, so I'll, I'll just, you know, put it to the side. And then a couple, I think either two days before Halloween or something like that, Devin's like, aren't we, weren't we doing something for Shion? I'm like, nah, I kind of gave up on it. And Devin's like, what? I've, I've never seen anything for Shion go through. Like, fall through. And I'm like, you know what, Devin? We're gonna make this happen! So for, like, literally two days, me and Devin just sat up and finished the episode. Like, two straight days. Like, yourself. We, didn't, we didn't sleep. No. We were up until, like, 8 a.m., both of us. I think I slept finally, like, 10 while the video was rendering and then I asked you pretty like, much like yeah, I was like weren't we doing a thing you're like yeah but we're not going to now no just do it just no quit. oh great make your yes, dream Devin <laughs> Devin I'm what have you done yesterday you said tomorrow you can't escape it <laughs> the hell I can't <laughs> I'm basically, okay. I'm basically Len. But we're, he's Len, I'm Len, she's Len, are there any other Lens we should know about? Banana. Me, no. I'm Len. <laughs> Banana! <laughs> roller, roller. Fucking Len. Roller, roller. Damn you, Len. Okay, how, here's a fun thing we can talk about. How does everybody feel oh, about okay. their characters? Oh, yay! <laughs> I love this question! Sweet. <laughs> I think that if I ever met Len, I would just hit him with a shovel repeatedly until he got the pussy knocked out of him and stood up for himself, or just died. Which I'd be okay with. <laughs> Daisy's a big fan of Len. Well, she on that. <laughs> Poor Len. <laughs> oh, my. Daisy likes normal Len, she just hates what I've done with him. He's such a pussy. I can't stand him. <laughs> <laughs> but plot twist, my favorite character is Rin. <laughs> oh man, <Plot> Rin. <laughs> Cause, you know, we twist plots around here. <laughs> oh, is it my turn? Yeah, go for it. I guess so, you're talking. Okay. Sure. <laughs> mm. 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 Okay, so 
my opinion of Kia Terahiyama in the sh- in the Kamen Rider Enterprise universe. Um, let's see. He's a fucking yuppie. What's a yuppie? He's a yuppie. <laughs> yep. I just. I think he's a yuppie. What's a yuppie? I'm glad you asked, Ari. <laughs> <laughs> yup. Harry, <laughs> look up the definition of yuppie. Because if I'm right, <laughs> if, if I'm you're right, right, I say um, shut up. He was oh. like, does he really mean just... he's white? <laughs> well, kind of. <laughs> he is literally just the most confusing motherfucker. I have had, I have had the. Basically, he's my only voice acting thing other than um, this one thing that I'm in. But other than that, like, the most confusing person I've ever had the thing, uh, the pleasure, pleasure, <laughs> of uh, voicing. Like, he he does I things. I don't know if I can say. He does things, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I just care a cat. It's a shame. Okay. What is it with everybody and their damn cats? I don't, have a cat. I don't have a cat. I don't have a cat. I have ferrets. Apparently it's someone else's cat. Anyways, Kyozy Yuppie. I really don't know what is going on through his genius ass head. And I say genius. I don't know what it's I'm just, on it. I'm on it. <laughs> Thank you, Ari. Get an Urban Dictionary for the best results. Webster. That did not be a word. Yuppie. It is a word. I've. I've Y u p p i e. Oh, here Informal it is. Informal for young urban professional or yup. Turned into yuppie in the 1980s, a term used to describe someone who is young, possibly just out of college, and who has a high-paying job and affluent lifestyle, can now be used to describe any rich person who is not modest about their financial status. <laughs> Yuppiedom is a term so Yama to describe... So, yuppie, not Kyo. So, Kyo's yeah. Kyo's all yuppies. So not and he's also yuppie. not young. Kyo's 40. Remember, Kyo he's was like a scientist. He was the high-paying job. That's a yuppie. <laughs> well, I mean... <laughs> The thing is, uh, I don't know if this is a spoiler or not, but he did struggle a lot in his earlier life, so it's not that so, he's like rich. He's just. just I can't remember him. If he wanted to be. Okay, so what? I can't remember Kyo? him and him and not Kyo is, struggle um, a lot. So he's not, is he's he's working class. He's not like a yuppie. If anything, Yamada would be the yuppie because okay, Yamada is just like rich and like happy, with, just like chilling. Okay. But I've been calling him yuppie all this time! You've been wrong. I've been wrong! You've been wrong. <laughs> Much like Kyo! <laughs> Mark, I can't even get you. That's how most... Oops. I hate Sorry. math. I hate you, Kyo, for, for being I, a math I, teacher. I, I want to I kick the living shit out of your pancreas. <laughs> Wait. That's Very not specific. nice! This is so diabetic is talking so here. He is. I love, I love how you say it's not nice when he says kick him in the pancreas. But when I say it, Len repeatedly with a shuffle, nobody bad an eye. I mean, everybody knows about your intense hatred for Xion Len. Speaking of intense <laughs> hatred, Tundra. Oh yes. <laughs> 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 I don't like kids at all, <laughs> and I voice one. Uh, yeah. But do you like I, ice cream? Uh, I, ice cream's fine. I don't. I don't dislike. I mean, I I, I like ice cream just fine. You know. <laughs> the fan girls gonna buy you ice cream. Now. They're gonna send you ice. Chocolate cream. malts. Chocolate. Malts, though, those those are damn good. Chocolate mm, malts. Their hair. <laughs> okay, well, uh, every time I have to say the line "dad" with a whiny <laughs> like connotation to it. <laughs> Fun fact: my you guys soul keep an eye open a little. Like Everybody say it now. Dad. 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 <laughs> keep your eyes open. I'm working on something. That. It's funny because Mario is dead. 
anymore. Daddy, daddy was there to change my underwear to take me to the fair. She doesn't care. Song is relevant, but also an Austin Powers reference. I really should not have watched that show as young as I did. That movie. None of them. Oh. I referenced Austin Powers and this 30-something-year-old co-worker that I hate to death. Um, was like, how do you know about Austin Powers? And I'm like, dude, I watched a movie. <laughs> Movies exist far <laughs> after they've been shot. And I watched that movie about. when I was like five years old. If any of you have actually seen that movie, that is not something a five-year-old should watch. Okay, I watched... Team America World Police uncut version when I was like nine. My mom if, has if that. you've seen that. Oh boy. <laughs> the old boy tells me that's not a good so much innocence to that movie. It's, it's kind of like that idea that if you aren't born in the 90s, you can't remember it. Mm. You are in a 90s kid. Ew. <laughs> 90s but elitism. To kind of go back on the top key thing. Kaito annoys me. I actually, like, hate to strong dislike Rin. Yeah. Oh. Especially later on. Rin, Rin can suck Kaito's non-existent metal penis. <laughs> oh. Oh. Is it wrong that I used to ship that somewhere? Why? Oh. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Cause like, cause like, I used, I used to think of uh, like when I was in a more avid Vocaloid shipper, I was like, like my head was like all the Vocaloids lived in lived in like dormitories near. I don't think the, anybody like, wants studio. to know what my head was prior to. Mine Shion. is that all of them live like, in mental wards. We all words. know, no, no. Like they all lived in like this whole building, and Kaito was an alcoholic. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, at least he wasn't in high school at twenty five. Like most people. <laughs> he was like 19 or something. Hi there, I'm 23 years old and I'm still in high school. There's a problem here. Yeah. <laughs> I know someone who graduated from high school at 21. See, I, I, I've heard of that, but like 25. Really? I just turned 21. <laughs> Let me tell you what the problem is here. There's not enough people dating me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I have that problem. So speaking of ships, Good. um, here's a ship that I used to have prior to Xi'an. Uh, I, I don't. I, no. SS boat. Kaito I, Kyo. Yeah, I used to ship Kaito and Kyo. Everybody oh used to gosh. ship Kaito Kyo. And, like then, and then Xi'an happened. I didn't even know Kyo existed before. And then some people still ship them. When Xi'an no. I can't ship them in Xi'an context. That's gross. If you ship it in Xi'an context, I'm going to be very mad at you. <laughs> There was a short period of time where I shipped Miku and Kyo, and now it's just like, no. No. Nobody should ever ship it Kyo. too. How? How did you ship them? Because I got shipped really cute pictures. They're so cute. Like, like, for real, though. I, I shipped them as father and daughter. Well, you see good action figures. You took I them don't anymore. I honestly, thought for, I honestly thought for a hot second that Yuki was Kyo's kid. I I, to, I, she was originally gonna terrified of the Kyo show. and Yuki ship. Yeah, oh my god. I'm like, I still am scared I of that ship. Have you seen pictures of them together? Uh, Yuki always looks like, like she's scared. going to rape Kyo. It's terrifying. Oh, no. <laughs> They're like, please, please, no. Oh, don't do this. Yep. You call Google. it terrifying. I call it Kodomonochi Khan. I'm not gonna ask what that means. Kyo looks so scared all the time. Yuki is good. Because he knows it's gonna be his fault. The wheels on the bus killed Kyo's kid. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Shigamune Nana and I don't condone child violence. I do if it's child on child violence. You need to stop. What, so what are we talking about? Not. Oh yeah, okay, it's Devin's turn. Devin, what do you think about your character? <laughs> I don't want to sound weird. It's okay. She is oh. Miku. Devin is Miku. We refuse to believe anything else. Devin is actually- Oh, speaking of which, I actually ate a leak today. I ate one the other Pat day. Is you ate a- I thought you ate a leak like a week ago. And then I ate another one today. <laughs> it's actually really, really good. Okay. About a week ago. A week ago. <laughs> he texted me out of the blue. I ate a leak. I'm glad you did like Wow, Maru. <laughs> 
Congratulations! I'm Lisa living the Miku life. <laughs> Wait, just a lake or was it a salad? Proud of all of you. It, it was ac it actually Wait, tasted yeah, like it, it was like the sensation was like it was spicy, but it wasn't. Yeah. What did Isn't What do you think like of radishes? Yeah, I hate radishes. Radishes aren't fun. I like radishes. No, they're not fun. Stop. Why then? Fight me, realize. <laughs> you know what I like? Yeah. Turn up. <laughs> okay, okay let's let's pick, let's have Devin finish. Please. Uh, well, <laughs> if the Xeon logic is canon now, if I'm Miku, then I think I should rule the world. <laughs> Devin, um, should, Devin for president. I guess I'm. I love Miku. I'm like the biggest Miku whore there is. <laughs> and uh, um, <laughs> I mean, like for real though, because Miku is really special to me because that's how I figured out about Vocaloid and how I met all, like literally like all the friends I have right now. That's like how I made like every friend that I have is through Miku. That I still have pretty much, like it, whether it's through cosplaying Miku or like singing as Miku or voice acting. Miku. So I pretty much owe my oh. life to Miku. Devin is also Miku. Miku, Miku, Miku. Who's Miku, 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 <laughs> We're eating potato mouth. chips. You shut your mouth when you're talking to me. <laughs> you don't brush your damn teeth when you're talking to Nana. <laughs> you don't think about like, soap. I'm sorry, I wanted to have dental hygiene. I was eating potato chips earlier today. Did you take one and eat it? <laughs> yeah. Took more than one and ate them. All. Mm -hmm. I'll take I got potato pot. chip. And eat it. I was actually. Um. <laughs> potato chip. I'm the one. <laughs> we have 11 minutes left. Is there anything else you'd like to ask us, Cole? You are wasting your time talking about weird crap. <laughs> oh, hold on. I think I might have lost the What? You're. What? Again. I need a new mic. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Either you're going mute or everyone else is going deaf. <laughs> I wouldn't be. I wouldn't doubt it at this point if I was going deaf. Shut up! I'm I don't know. They're gagging him. Is it his room every time he talks? No, no, no. Oh, we didn't get to do a read through. Do you wanna do a read through? Nada. <laughs> oh, I wanna do yeah. a read through. Nada, it's been like two years. Shut up, Maru. <laughs> Two <laughs> years. Two oh, yeah, years cool have passed. Su <laughs> it's summer now. Hey, hey, Maru, Maru. Yeah. Every day let it go. Let it go. No more pulls it. Okay, okay, Casey. <laughs> summer uh, now. Casey. I still need some help. Slip frozen. So let it go. I understand, but the fact so. is, whenever I try to let it go, everyone keeps bringing it back up. Ah. Anyway. <laughs> Get it out, get it out. Stop. Get no. Song out. no more. <laughs> okay. So, tell you. I, I have happened. a mad lip here of Frozen's Let It Go oh, from no. a concert I went to. Oh, God. Would any, anyone here like to hear it? Yes. It's going to be uh, the no. last 10 minutes of our call. <laughs> I'm in for it. This is like. So well. I don't remember how exactly the song goes, so I'm just going to BS it. Yay. As much as I can. The song glows white oh, no. on the bathroom tonight. <laughs> Not a footprint to be seen. A kingdom hey, of potato dildos. <laughs> <And it's> like, <laughs> potato dildos? I'm the queen. <laughs> <laughs> no. The no. wind is howling like the swirling left nut inside. 
couldn't Mr. keep Moon, it in. Sulu knows I tried. Don't <laughs> let them in. Don't let them see. Be the a stripping surfer you always have to be. Conceal, don't feel. Don't Why did I come back? <laughs> <laughs> don't let them check your nuts. Well, now they eat a dick. I can't. <laughs> Can't Dick. hold it back any <laughs> Through my ass, sniff my ear, turn away and shit your pants. <laughs> I don't care what they're going to say. Let the angry boner rage on. <laughs> angry smegma never Mama? bothered me anyway. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Let it grow? What? No. <laughs> what? Uh, yes. uh, <laughs> We're spending like five minutes talking about Frozen. So yeah. that is from my Brental Floss concert that I went to. Good times. That was beautiful. Thank you for sharing that. Okay. All right. Um, oh, Brental. Well, thank let's you. see. You have seven minutes left, Chloe. You anything else you'd like? I to freaking talk? love Brental Floss. Yes. <sighs> okay. Are you wasted so typing? much time? <laughs> There's like half. It was fun. <laughs> Question. Yes, you will be receiving the um, thing for the stuff and the place. Right. All right, so. Any last mm. questions or comments you'd like to ask? Remember, what's something that, you know, for an anonymous? Well, I, the only thing I'd add is, like, will you be making more, like, um, short vids? Like, as I said, for example, Halloween. Short vids like the Halloween? Yeah, something like that. Hopefully, yeah. We'll do it in that similar style for, like, holidays and stuff, just because simply it's just quicker than animating. And, um... But, yeah, we definitely intend to do more short little skits. Especially the short little skits. Actually, on Patreon... Actually, I'd like to throw this out there as well. On Patreon, um, as soon as we hit uh, $50, we release short skits. We actually hit $50. We actually hit $100. So, hopefully, a skit will be coming your way soon, so please keep your eyes open for it. You guys will love it. Yay. Yay. <laughs> There's a nice hit on my Ask page, for the Ask page for Xion, if anybody wants a little, you know, sneak preview about what could possibly be. Look at, look at Nana's stuff. Look at my things. <laughs> look at her stuff. Please don't say Isn't it like it that. Isn't Wouldn't you say her repertoire is complete? Mario, please Wouldn't don't you creepy. say she's the girl who Mario. directs? She on shit. Okay, you have like five minutes. Left. Mm. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's see. Is there any uh, previous works you guys did? Well, well, not all of you. Previous work? Well, I mean, in terms but, of collaborative effort, definitely Shion is the first thing that I've worked with most of these people, mm. all of these people with. Um, I, uh, I've written stories in the past, and I'm actually, you know, writing, I, I continue to write stories not related to Xion. I actually have one story related to Xion that I'm working with. But everybody, you know, before Xion, we all had our own things that we worked on, and Xion is basically what brought us together as a team. Right, right. <laughs> Something else I'd like to mention that I'd like, you know, people, if they want to keep an eye out for I'm making a before story for Xion as well. Going to be mainly about Kiyotaru, though. Yeah, no, no fun, fan favorite Yamada stuff, but it's still awesome. I actually, uh, I actually. Kind it of might only be a manga though for now. I don't know if I'm going to be doing any animation with it. But actually, really, Ooh, a web comic. Yeah, possibly a web comic, but yes, please keep your eyes open for it. Those of you that are listening. I actually, um, uh, kind of look forward to that mainly because well there's more stuff for Keo instead of like aside from all this robot stuff there's a lot you more stuff. <laughs> another thing I'd like to mention is that we also don't want to end it with Xion. Xion was the first thing that got all of us into production but certainly won't be the last hopefully um, once Xion ends and even possibly before it even ends We'll have other things going on with us, so we're not gonna ever fade away. We'll just, you know, take on different projects. 
and Ooh. we'll just we'll, you know morph into different things. Take we'll do what we can. Things. Yes, we'll become That's a production. Exciting. Company. So hopefully you'll hear a lot more from Common Audio Enterprise and just Shion on in the future. We all have our own channels too. Yes, I can. Yes, I'll, yes. I'll uh, put everybody that's in this call. I'll put them their links in the description. That of would be great. Is there anything else that you'd like, really quick, to say to your fellow fans, or you'd like us to say, or you'd like to ask us? Something like, "Hi, mom." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Hi, mom. Like, oh, hey guys, I'm on YouTube. <laughs> but no, I was just saying, well, it was fun, and um, thank you for this call. I was going to say that. Mm -hmm. said thank you for the call. Thank you for the call. It was a pleasure thank meeting you. you guys and something else. Yes, that was it. We really appreciate you hanging out with us today. It was really fun. We yeah, it was really fun. We I'm also sorry that we rambled over your life, but um, it was nice uh, to meet you too. Oh, it's no. <laughs> Uh, I'm not sure if this is the case with you, but it's usually no big deal. Wallflowers usually get the most out of a conversation just by listening. What? I think Mar is trying to justify the fact that we talked over Koyu. Yes, I am. <laughs> this is Mar, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> and my uh, favorite voice actor. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> well, I had a lot of fun. I had fun too. Um, it was it was great linking up with you guys, and knowing that I'm somebody's favorite. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm gonna end it here because we only have like 45 seconds left. Thank you so much, Cody, for supporting us. If you'd like to join a, a Skype call with us someday, make sure to check out our Patreon. And we, I think it's for ten dollars, five dollars. You get a, a chat with us for an hour. Five. It's really fun. Dollars. You can ask us whatever you want. You can listen to us ramble about random crap. You can get us to say fun things and ask us, you know, some cool questions that you probably didn't know about Xi'an. So again, thank you so much for watching and thank you for all your support. We love you guys. Bye. 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 Bye.